What's up guys, uh, I'm Saeed with you today. I'm going to talk about top 11 software of Linux operating system. So number one, VLC player. This is the most famous video player for Linux user. But uh, here is a problem uh, if you are a Windows user and uh, you used KMP player, you will definitely do know that um, you can uh, go forward backward by using forward key and backward key and uh, um, increase and decrease your volume by up arrow and down arrow you can also do it here so for this you have to customize this so for customize this uh, go to preference from tools and uh, select hotkeys and now you can uh, select uh, Full screen for enter I have already assigned you can uh, assign it but just double click it and uh, hit enter then assign or uh, hit other um, key that you want to use as shortcut here I also set forward and backward key for short jump and forward jump and backward jump now you can see I can use um, forward key and backward key for I can use left key and right key for uh, going forward and going backward I can use uh, up arrow and down arrow for increase volume and decrease volume number two unity tweak tool unity tweak tool gives you an opportunity for change your theme icon cursor font and all and uh, window controls and so on you can uh, change your theme from here and uh, you can select your theme one more thing I should remember you you will not find this theme uh, installed by default you have to install it uh, manually I have installed it uh, manually you will find uh, how to install Mac theme uh, in the description below I have another video about uh, this topic so here you can change a uh, theme uh, icon and you can also change your uh, window controls close and uh, minimize button so number three compile config manager to com customize your ubuntu but uh, you should uh, remember that uh, it's a very advanced tool it can destroy your operating system so you should uh, be careful when you are using this um, with, with this you can uh, use desktop cube desktop wall where you can uh, use many workplace at a time if we select a desktop cube you can see the animation here you'll find the desk cube desktop and you can uh, move your desktop by pressing ctrl and drag your mouse If I use another uh, application, I can uh, go one from work workplace to an another workplace by control left arrow, control alter left arrow, and right arrow. I can use cube recollection. So when I press control and drag my mouse, you'll find this animation. Using this Confess Config Manager, you can also uh, have this uh, minimize and unminimize effect, and that's it. Number four is Docky. Number five, Chrome and Firefox. I said Chrome and Firefox because uh, some people doesn't like Chrome because Chrome uh, is not secure browser. Chrome save your password, all password. But I like Chrome because uh, I can use here uh, Google Photos, Google Plus, Drive and everything here. Um, but uh, if anyone you uh, get your email and email password then they can 
have your all password because Chrome said if you consider about the security, Firefox is best browser then. Number six, Kazam. Kazam is a screen recorder. Uh, also, now I'm using also you can uh, Kazam. You can see here up here. It's really awesome my screen recorder. I love that uh, there is also another screen recorder, uh, simple screen recorder. Simple screen recorder is also good. Number seven, VMware. Using VMware, you can uh, create a virtual machine, then you can install Windows or Mac here. Here you can see I have another tutorial about this topic, how to run Mac on VMware. So you can, uh, if you wanna install Adobe application or uh, Microsoft Office or something like that, uh, you cannot uh, install it uh, in Linux operating system. You can use, you can use easily use virtual machine VMware to install Windows operating system or Mac operating system. Then you can install it, use it. So number eight, Skype. If you love uh, video conference or uh, and then video conference then skype is best you'll find skype for in mac os and uh, windows operating system number nine libreoffice libreoffice is not just like um, microsoft office but it's not microsoft office but uh, using libreoffice you can uh, do um, the work of uh, excel and uh, for presentation uh, you can also use it Number 10, Sublime Text. Sublime Text is awesome text editor. If you are a programmer, then uh, it's really good for you. You'll find it in uh, also Mac for Mac and Windows. You can select syntax and here you can see it supports C, C Sharp, C++, CSS, HTML, Java and so on. Let's select HTML. So now can uh, now we can use shortcut here also it's uh, i like this because uh, it's background color and text color it's really awesome so that's it number 11 kdn life it's an awesome video editor some people say it, uh, that uh, it allows you have almost everything you can do almost everything that sony vegas do you have to pay for reuse sony vegas but kdn life fully free it's really awesome video editor